Hi, my name's Lucy Edwards. I'm 27 years old and I'm a broadcaster, journalist and content creator who lives in Birmingham. I am completely blind and as part of my work day to day, I consult with brands and organisations to make a fairer world for little Lucy's like me. That's my why, that's why I get up every morning. And I have some advice for my younger self that I want to give you today. Surround yourself with people who care and champion you. Eventually, there will become a time that you will have some self-acceptance. I remember feeling like a stranger in my own body when I first lost my eyesight and it was so hard to understand who Lucy was and especially being a teenager you just you really don't understand the person that you're going to become it's such a it's such a crazy time and what I would say to anyone going through that at the minute is it will all become clear your path will become clear just keep going bit by bit, take a little block, build up one step at a time, brick by brick, and then eventually you will have your house and it will be built. It'll become clearer. When I lost my eyesight, I felt like I was just surviving, not thriving. And it can feel like that sometimes when you hit a roadblock or something happens to you in your life. But what you have to remember is even if you can't see the light, you need to be able to feel the sun on your skin, the warmth that it brings. There will be a light at the end of the tunnel. And it sounds cliche, but I really do believe the more you look for positivity, the quicker you will find it in everything that you do. My pledge today is to always be a self-confident, blind, disabled woman. I love who I am now. I think I am the best version of myself. Being blind and doesn't mean I don't have any vision to choose what I want to do and be the independent person that I've always wanted to be. I have wings today and I want to say to you that I'm going to prove to you that being self-confident is something that you can be one day and I want to be a role model to every disabled girl out there.